Drake and Hilliard emerge. Hilliard in the pick game as well. And Cincinnati has won back-to-back -back outright conference champions for the first time since 1951 and 1952 when they won the Mid-American Athletic Conference. Gilliard's 374 total yards, and Pike hit his last 11 passes, and the Cincinnati defense was superb in the second half. And here's Holly Rowe. Coach, there was a point in this game, you guys were down 31-10. What started to change at that point? We just keep playing, and, and I told them at halftime, look, we, we just stay together, keep fighting. Uh, that's been our style all year, and, and we just made some more plays down the stretch. Um, I'm just so proud of our football team and the way they persevered. Tony Pike was struggling at one point in this game. You guys had some good words on the sideline. How did that get turned around? Well, you know, I just told him you got to be more aggressive. You're in a championship game. You can't wish and hope. You got to go get it and go do it. And uh, he responded with some big plays. At the end of the day, though, Coach, your defense had to come alive, and they did. What was different about them? Um, I, I just think that they dug down deep. We're, you know, we're, we're far from far from perfect defensively but those kids play so hard and kept fighting and um, again at the end of the day we had to make a couple of stops and we did coach you're perfect on the season what consideration does this team deserve hey you know we want them all um, beat, beat some really good football teams and um, we'll be rooting hard uh, I love Mac Brown at Texas but uh, we'll be rooting pretty hard for Nebraska go Nebraska go Cornhuskers thanks coach Kelly <laughs> if the national championship dreams are still alive, there's no question they are the Big East champions outright, and they're on their way to a BCS Bowl for the second year in a row. Deion Lewis, 47 carries, 194 yards and three touchdowns in defeat for Pittsburgh. Along the river, they'll be talking about that missed extra point for a long time. 45-44 the final for complete wrap-up of this game. ESPN News in just a few minutes. Great action on ABC. Arizona and USC tonight at 8. Brian Kelly be watching Texas and Nebraska. For Matt Millen, Holly Rowe, Sean McDonough, so long from Pittsburgh.